Hi guys, it's Steve from Disruptive Wealth Creation. Today, I discuss why investing in Tesla is a no-brainer. Watch this space and find out why. There are several reasons why Tesla is a good investment. Firstly, it's the biggest worldwide brand in EV cars in the world. And from a racing car point of view, it is still in pole position to exploit the rapidly growing market. Some customers are switching to cleaner vehicles as they worry over the environment and climate change, while others are changing due to government regulations on cleaner cars. In the UK, for example, you will no longer be able to purchase a diesel or petrol car after 2030. Tesla's success is due to their vertical integration approach, unlike other companies that buy their parts and just put them together. They've also introduced the new casting machines, which are working together with robots to bring down the costs of manufacture. Every new factory they open is more cost efficient than the last one and is able to produce more cars. It's true that Tesla share market has dipped a little with over 150 car companies coming into the market, mainly in China and bringing out cheaper cars. But customers are soon finding out that the quality of these cars and their performance is nowhere near Tesla's. To combat this erosion of market share, Tesla are working on their new under $25,000 car. Some call it the Model 2. This is doable. You only have to look at the new Model 3, which will soon be selling under $28,000. The new Model 2 will be a smaller car with fewer frills and it'll be just as good as the other cars, but more affordable. So what makes investors cautious about investing in Tesla? Firstly, there is Elon Musk's crazy political views and comments, which some feel diminishes his Tesla brand. Personally, I do not agree with many of the things that Elon says. They're a bit outlandish, but you get this with the eccentric billionaires. Secondly, there is Twitter, which uh, a year ago burned a hole in Elon Musk's pocket. But since then, Twitter has been managed by a new CEO, and Elon has distanced himself away from Twitter. This blow-up could soon re-emerge, with Mark Zuckerberg bringing out his own version of Twitter. Personally, I think these things are just distractions, which are blown out of proportion by the media. Getting back to cars, investors do sometimes get concerned about recalls of cars. In 2022, Tesla had 3.2 million recalls. But two things need to be remembered about this. Firstly, recalls are not uncommon. It happens all the time with car manufacturers. And secondly, the majority of recalls from Tesla were done virtually online, so there was no need to take your car back to the garage. Investors need to be looking at the more positive things that are happening with Tesla. The continued expansion of gigafactories worldwide, not just in manufacturing, but also in making batteries. Tesla also has other income streams from making cars. They have the most charging stations in the world. Unlike other car manufacturers like Ford and GM, who are now going to have to rely on using Tesla charging stations to charge their cars. Finally, and most importantly, Tesla should not be judged as a car company, but as a tech company or an energy company. When people look at Tesla, they should compare it not with GM and Ford, but with companies like Apple. You only have to look at Tesla's technology, which proves this. So, are you investing in Tesla? Let me know in your comments below. And if you are, new to the channel, don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next one.